Hi, good morning everyone. Myself Anur Raghun. Today I will discuss about IATF 16949-2016. First of all, please subscribe my channel. Find is everything is my channel and, and please watch my full video. Today my session is basically based on IATF 16949-2016. Today I will discuss about clause number 8 operation. My last session I had already discussed about clause number 4 context of the organization, clause number 5 leadership, clause number 6 planning and clause number 7 support. Today I will discuss about clause number 8 operation. Before coming on topic, I will just give the overview of what is IATF 16949-2016. IATF 16949-2016 is a standard that is basically used for automotive industries and also is aligned with the structure of ISO 9001-2015 and is a high level structure standard. Now come on topic and just give the overview of clause number 8 operation. Basically this clause include the requirement on planning, product requirements review, design, purchase, creating the product and service and controlling the equipment that is used for monitoring and measure the product and service. Basically this clause have 7 sub clauses. Now I am just give the overview of all 7 clauses. Basically the clause number 8 is operation. This clause has 7 sub clauses. First is the operation planning and control and control clause number 2 sub clauses 2 is requirement 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 of product and service services. The sub clauses 3, the requirement of sub clauses 3 is the design and development design and development of product and service and the sub clauses number 4 the requirement of this clause is the control of control of external provided external provided products process product and service and the sub clauses 5 define the Production, product, product and service provision. And the, the sub clauses seven define the and the release the release the requirement of release the requirement of of product and service and service and the last sub clause 7 that is control on control on non conforming output non conforming output output this this is a sub clause number 8.1 this is a sub clause number 8.2 this is sub clause number 8.3 this is sub clause number 8.4 this is sub clause number 8.5 this is sub clause number 8.6 and this is clause 8.7 the all clauses that is 
की ऑफ आई आई टी एफ वन सिक्स नाइन फोर नाइन टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन सो बेसिकली दिस क्लॉज ऑपरेशन प्लानिंग एंड कंट्रोल दिस क्लॉज इंक्लूड द रिक्वायरमेंट ऑफ कस्टमर स्पेसिफिक रिक्वायरमेंट कस्टमर प्रोटेक्ट स्पेसिफिक रिक्वायरमेंट प्रोडक्ट डिजाइन टेक्निकल स्पेसिफिकेशन एक्सेप्टेंस क्राइटेरिया लॉजिस्टिक रिक्वायरमेंट and also that is most important thing is the acceptance criteria of this clauses requirement of product and service this clauses basically include the requirement of communication what is the communication between customer and suppliers if your if your customer is outsources if your customer is outside the india if your customer is maybe your germany maybe your spanish maybe your usa you first of the communication process may be the depend on the customer requirement that is very important this clauses this clauses that is very important and that is very big sub clause design and development of product and service the this clauses basically uh, deal with the dfma apqp phases uh, the design input design output that is all of things is included in this clauses and this clauses the control of external provide product and process and service this clauses basically deal with the supplier product requirement supplier quality management system supplier audit second party audit the requirement of uh, supplier approval product that is all of things that is very important supplier audit supplier acceptance supplier uh, ranking all of the things this include in this clauses this clauses product and service provision this clauses basically deal with the deal with the job setup requirement um, uh, job setup requirement wi work standard uh, standardized work process control plan everything that is include in this sorry control plan not include in this and uh, and the final six clause lacks the requirement of product and service this is basically the requirement of this include the this clause this sub clause include the uh, like layout inspection that is included in this requirement and the final is the control of non conforming output means uh, control of rework product control of repair product control of um, some customer dealing product that is very important in this clauses so i think it's very important for you and you will be very easily for i am just give the overview and but this clause very uh, this very big clauses and also i am just give the how this clause work on pdc cycle so please note down all of the things that is very important basically the last four clauses my last four clauses is uh sorry uh, the pdc cycle the four first clauses the context of the organization organization leadership planning planning and support this four clauses clause number 4 5 6 7 8 it is a phase of planning and now the operation operation is the phase of do and the next uh, video i will just give the overview of clause number 9 improvement uh, in uh, sorry the clause number 9 inform uh, evolution and clause number 10 improvement so i think uh, you will like my video so please if you like my video please share subscribe and watch my full video thank you and good luck